Hello guys, once again, thank you. This is James with JGZ Adventures. We are in Turkey. We're here visiting Mary's house and we're gonna go up. This place is very beautiful. Um ano depois, dois padres de colégio and Jewish people during the Ottoman times as they lived together under the same empire so uh, of course they lived uh, they lived peacefully or they learned how to live together so today also uh, you can believe in whatever you want in Turkey but mostly Muslim uh, country so the difference between Islam and Christianity about Jesus, Jesus was the son of God, you know, for Christians, but Muslim people believe that he was the prophet of the God. Moses was the first prophet and then Jesus. They believe that Muhammad is the last one, their prophet, yeah. you know. But still, Virgin Mary was the mother of the prophet, so this is so important. Nome de Maria, como eu falei, passando de uma outra mão. Ela tem um capítulo, The Birth of the Virginia, and she's the only woman. So, uh, still honor them. Yeah. And just like Christians, Muslim people, and you can see those. And because of being the mother of a prophet, or the mother of Jesus, so they call her Mother Mary more than Virgin Mary. Okay, because being mother is more important. And especially in Anatolia, who thousands of years, they had mm, really big respect uh, to the mother. <laughs> Do they believe in immaculate conception? I mean, um, actually, they exactly the same story. Yes, okay. yes, okay. they exact the same story. 
um, but um, it, I mean, it's like that actually. Uh, Joseph, they accept Joseph as the, father. as the father, yes, but um, they accept the only man. languages but in English it is this one here and what is the story about how how could they find a house here uh, it's about a German nun who lived at the end of the 19th century in Germany and uh, this nun became badly and she was falling into deep sleeps and deep dreams so in her dreams um, she started to uh, describe the house of Mary and the area where she lived, where she was in trance. So one German journalist started to take notes uh, what she said and the visions of her. So one day he published a book about the visions of her. So you see the statue of her here, uh, the team who founded the uh, house, you know, it's the gift of them. So, and he published a book, and this book was translated into French from German. The French fathers who were living in Izmir, one hour away from here, they read this book and they real they understood that you know the description is so similar with this region. They founded a team, and when this team came here searching for the house here they were so thirsty and they talked to the locals and uh, asked for water source the locals said that go on at the top there is one water source when they came here they found the water source here and it's on this bottom street there you know people accept this water as holy water Which are darker red parts. So these, this section at the bottom is the original walls. Okay. So the reconstructed part is the upper part. I mean, mostly it is reconstructed. Yes. In 1951. Then in 1961, um, it was confirmed as the Marys. So by the Pope John the Twenty Third, and then 1967 uh, Paul the Sixth came, 1979 John Paul the Second, and 2006 Benedict the Sixteenth came and visited the house. So when you go inside, you are going to see the gifts at the corners of the walls, uh, the gifts from the Pope. And when you put one step inside, please look to your left side. You are going to see the photo of Anna, Catherine and Mary, the German nun. So from the visions of her, they found out. And there is only one statue inside of Virgin Mary. So uh, they found it near by a river here and no hands because they couldn't find it. Okay. So then they made all the replicas uh, same because this is the uh, so common question why doesn't she have hands? Uh, they could have found a statue like that. 
So it's strictly forbidden to take photos inside. Outside, you can take the photos, and there are candles inside. You can take them, and with uh, little donations to the house. So there is a prayer area outside. This is the mass area. You know, uh, the religious service every Sunday for the Christians who live around here, and sometimes even from the cruises we have the people. What type of what type of mass is it? Is it a Catholic mass? That Catholic, a... because yes, this is a really good question. Because this belief is a Catholic belief, not an Orthodox belief. Orthodox people they believe that they accept that okay, Mary visited Ephesus, but she turned back and died in Gethsemane in Jerusalem. Catholic people believe that Mary died in Ephesus, and you know, so Vatican people, this place is the house of Virgin Mary, but even between the sects, yes. Between their beliefs, there, there is a little bit difference. All right, guys, so, hope you enjoyed it. I will be going in. And there's no cameras inside here, so I'm gonna have to turn this off. And so. there are fountains there, drinkable water. You guys have a good day.